Hello everyone, I am Abhimanyu Burgaupar, working as a Microsoft Certified Developer. Now I am going to give a demo on how to build Mule application on Maven using Mule ASP. So my agenda will be introduction to Maven, Maven overview, benefits of Maven, demonstration on building project with Maven. I will show live demo on Maven. Introduction to Maven. Maven is a project management utility that you can use to develop projects in Mule. Mule provides built-in Maven functionality. Maven tools for Mule ESP is a plugin that provides archetypes for building regular Mule applications, allowing you to develop Mule application from within Maven. The ESB Maven plugin allows you to control Mule ESB instances within a Maven environment. Maven overview. When you build your application on Maven, the POM file will be automatically generated which contains built life cycle which is having goals and phases. All the dependencies jar files will be downloaded automatically. We will also add other built-in plugin and build profiles in our Maven configuration. Now we will be seeing Maven benefits. When you create a new Mule project using MuleSoft Mule project archetype or create Maven enabled project in studio. You can be confident that you are working with the correct Mule project folder structure and basic set of standard dependencies. If you are working with Maven in studio, studio automatically manages your POM file every time. You add new elements to your flow that require additional dependencies. Using Maven, you can program automatic builds using external frameworks such as Bamboo for continuous integration. The Maven POM file makes sharing projects easier and more lightweight because the POM reference the dependencies so that you don't have to manually find and include every dependency within the project itself. If you are working in team, each team member might have different studio configuration or be referencing different dependencies version. Using Maven to manage the build ensures that the resulting final build is sentinized and standardized. Demonstration on building project with Maven. The Mule Maven ESB plugin allows to you Mule application to different to deploy in different kinds of servers, standalone server, both community and enterprise, clustered, any point runtime manager and cloud hub. It is a part of framework for developing Mule application with Maven. The most important capabilities provided by the plugin are running integration test and deploying application to different environments. Now I will show the demo on Maven so that we need to go and download the Apache Download the Apache Maven. Once you will download the Apache Maven zip file, you will be extract that file. After extracting that file, after that you need to extract that file. After that you need to go system setting advanced system properties and add the environment variable. You need to add m2 underscore home is a variable name and the variable value is give the path up to bin folder of extracted zip file. But before that you must have JDK version installed in your uh, laptop or in your system. After this go to any point studio, go to windows, go to preferences. After that go to any point studio, go to Maven, here browse the path up to bin folder only. So I am having extracted the file which is having C Maven up to bin only provided that path location. After that base command line for builds, 
default group ID for new project. Keep as it is default. Test it Maven configuration. Once you will click on test Maven configuration, once you will get the success, after that click on OK button. Now build your application on Maven. So now you are ready with Maven. So create a new project. Go to Maven settings, use Maven settings and keep group ID, artifact ID and version as a default. If you want to change it, change it. Just after that click on next button and finish it. So now I have developed my flow on Maven built-in plugin. So in this use case I will show to you how I build that flow on Maven. So this use case will describe about there are customers they are sending their uh, order details. So depending on order item we are calculating uh, price for each item. So in that flow my flow contains HTTP which is having path and in connector configuration I am having host is localhost and port is 8081. After that I am converting JSON data which is sending from the customer I need to convert that J JSON data into java.util.hashmap we need to convert into key value pairs of that data so custom business event here it is accepting key values only so our event name is price so we are able to add the keys here so from my from my payload there are three data is coming like item name item unit item price per unit after that in ruby i am calculating the discount is like case when the payload from item name is coming when it is a shoe then we will be having a discount 0.1 when it is jeans it will be having 0.2 percent of discount when it is jacket it will be having 0.3 percent of discount so after that I, I will be printing item price per unit after that I am converting that into string format after in set payload I am writing that item price per unit after discount what it will be displayed means it is having payload after that I am printing all the data in console so now in my file the POM file is automatically generated see this form POM file is automatically generated if you want to add some external modules you are also added if you want to add a mule dependency also you can add in POM file also so it will make changes in your flow also so we are able to deploy our application on Maven So now we are running our application on Maven. So it will be providing pre-integration testing, post-integration testing. At the same time we are able to deploy our application on Cloud Hub Runtime Manager even though we are able to deploy our application on MMC also. So our application gets deployed. I have added in my POM file some external things like I need to be deploy my flow in runtime manager as well as cloud hub so I have added the plugin external which is I am providing the configuration like this like it is deployment type is cloud mule version after that username and password of any point uh, platform 
if you need to if we store all this thing in form dot file we will be deploy our application directly to cloud hub if we want to perform pre integration testing and post integration testing we will configure like this in plugin we need to configure the same thing for we need to perform pre integration test even after that we will perform if something gets maven fail safe plugin is occur at the time we will perform post integration testing so here we are able to test it continuously so it is providing continuously testing if we want to deploy our application on cloud hub we need to deploy directly to cloud hub if you want to deploy our application on mmc we are deploy our application on mmc also so now we have deployed our application on maven on maven so we will test it so i am sending customer data so my item is shoes which is having item units is 2 and item price per unit is 10 so here we will get the response is 200 and after that we will get item price per unit after discount is 9 to learn more about from our channel visit our channel and just see our previous videos automatic iib deployment using ibm ucd learn about the capabilities of salesforce integration where we will be providing migration broadcast aggregation bidirectional sync and correlation check out more on our youtube channel to learn more visit our website www.miraclesoft.com tweet us at the @team_msf you can watch our videos youtube.com/miracle45625 like our facebook page facebook.com/miracle45625 thank you